make sure that you stay tuned right until the end of the video for a chance to see some outtakes. Enjoy! <laughs> Welcome to another video, welcome to some glorious sunshine after the torrential downpour we've had today. Um, while I was on holiday I painted some plant pots, so this is the first one I painted, yellow and blue. Just spin it around a little bit so you can see, there you go, it's yellow and blue, triangles. It has a matching base for it as well, so it matches the top. And then I also painted the second one, it's this lovely pink, blue and grey one, which I really like. Um, yeah, and that also has a matching base for it. So I've decided that I'm going to plant some plants in these and they're going to be coloured plants and we're going to stick them by the front door. And then I also found this in the greenhouse. My dad has drilled some holes in it so that we've got some drainage. I I think I have everything that I need. I've got my watering can, I have some compost, a trowel, I've got our broken pot and stones to help with drainage. So yeah, let's give this a go. First of all, I think is probably sorting out the draining. So I guess maybe we should definitely clean these because I found a little slug. Yeah, mm, maybe, maybe. I wish I had a bucket. I wish I had a bucket. Right. But I didn't find a bucket. Are you leaking? Not a clue. Right. One stone down. A load more to go. Right, so I've got all of my little stones and stuff, so let's try, I think I need to put this, let's start with the small pot, I don't know, I think that one might work, oh you're gonna die on me! I think I may have found a cameraman though. Right, I've got one pot done. Put some rocks in the bottom to help with drainage. Why is there broken pots? Well, I found the broken pots, but you might have put like stones and broken pot in the bottom to help with the drainage. Oh. Now for the big one. Are those holes uh, drilled in? Yeah, Dad drilled them in. Yeah. I think this one might be the hardest one to do, and this is where I might actually have to crack a pot. Oh, yay! <laughs> That's more like it. See, this is where you could be filming what I'm doing. It's just looking at my face at the moment, Matthew. <laughs> Probably move that out of the way. I don't want this bit to got too much green on it. Maybe. It's gonna be under dirt. It's gonna get green on it regardless. Yeah, but you meant to like, if you're using old pots, like reusing old pots, you meant to like soak them in bleach. Oh. Um, which I only found out when I watched a video after I'd bought all these plants, so I'm like, mm. stuff in it. I mean, I assume it would be because it's it, it's it's rocks. I hope I haven't put too much in. No, you shouldn't do. 
Maybe you haven't seen what plants need to go in. That's a good point, I haven't. One thing I forgot to do last time I was planting plants was um loosen the soil that they are in. Way! Look at that, it's a stone. And there we go. Oh, I missed a slug, you're not meant to be in there. Yeah, just drown a slug. Perfectly yeah, if you can ask one to come out, you've cut off my head. There's not much I can do. Right you tilt it back a little bit. But it's about the flowers. <laughs> what about I'm scared of like damaging the plant. It's like crunching as I'm trying to. I thought I picked a nice plant. It seems kind of. Okay, that seems fairly loose. Okay, we've hit a roadblock. Hi. I've hit like two roadblocks. Uh, I'm struggling to loosen the soil. Yeah, yeah that okay, one wobbles. We'll just put it in. Um, but I don't think I'm gonna get two, let alone three, in this pot. We'll get two in. Really? Yeah, you've squeezed two in. But I've not got a lot of space left in it. Yeah, well, I took some of that out. There's not a lot of soil in it. It's got stones in the bottom to help with the drainage. You get another one in there easily. Just decide which one it's gonna be. Well, it's gonna be this one. Reckon I could get four in that one then. You got four left. I'll I'll have a spare one. Hmm? After what I planned. Right. You just need to bed them in. You will stick it in. Give a good squeeze in. Not gonna go in. Sit. That's in. not in. <laughs> That is not in! <laughs> <laughs> okay. Best way to do it is rather than just pushing push, pushing from the sides, like break, try and break down the soil on your back. You can fit more than one in weirdly. Bye! Bye! Yeah, I'm not sure why you need big stones in it. To help with the drainage, which doesn't have to be that big. I don't know, I could probably try and. I would get some small. I can't go for the same gaps. I think they're gonna die. I think they will blossom and flourish if you water them. There's one done. Let's go back and fit all the other ones in. Mummy to the rescue. Yay! If they die, it's your fault, Rob. <laughs> That's not fair! These three were meant to go in together. I think they'll look quite nice. This one's gonna like blossom with some white flower. Excuse me, hopefully this is going to blossom with some pink flowers, this is just green, and then this is going to blossom with some purple flowers, so hopefully all look quite nice. I really hope we can fit all four of these in here. Hopefully our other two plants should fit in these corners. I really hope these aren't gonna die because of this. Right. <laughs> Everyone breathe. Fingers crossed. Pray. Come on. There'll be some people watching this video who are genuine gardeners going, What are you doing? <coughs> like, I'm sorry, I'm a novice. I don't know what I'm doing. This was a bad idea. Hmm. No, this is a bad idea. This isn't going to work. These are going to die. Because <laughs> they're just, like... They both spread out, don't worry. They spread to where? <laughs> There's no space. I'm really worried about this one. Because I think this is, like... Literally going to pop off. Oh, no, you... Silly little thing. Get off my plant. That's technically a cup of flowers. Okay, we have one plant to go. I think I've reset the pot. These pots look so clean when I started. Now they don't. Now this whole table looks a mess. Here is the final one. It's called a Veronica. In Georgian blue. I sound like I'm talking about nail polish colours. Or paints. So many roots, look at that. Oh no, I'm out of soil. And I think that 
is our final plant. So I'm going to go position them. And then water them, I think. Or should I water them here and then position them? Right, let's go position these. Grab this one and its tray. Got it right here. And I'm back for the final one. Why don't I show you the good work that's been done? Right, so this is what we've got. We Look at all the hard work we've put in, guys. What a good job we've done. I just hope these survive. Also, this is the carnage from them. <laughs> Yeah, utter carnage. If you liked that video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more of my videos, make sure to click the subscribe button. It's free. Or you can click on my face right here. If you want to know exactly when my videos come out, make sure to click the little bell icon. And while you're at it, why not click over here for a video that you might have missed. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye!